four-year, $48 million deal. And by the way, his very first move as the executive was to sign Lamar Odom, who was on crack. <laughs> wait, I mean, wait, look, who? No, Phil I don't, or Lamar? I don't mean to, uh, Phil or Lamar. Lamar? I don't mean to be... Listen, I love Lamar Odom, the person, and God bless him. We're wishing nothing but the best. But metaphorically speaking, he saw his first move as the executive of the New York Knicks was to sign Lamar Odom, who was on crack. Well, how about this, Stephen A? Look, man, I mean, you, you got to be kidding. I love Derrick Rose off the floor. I don't love him on the floor. I oh, do not love, what? I do not what? love. What? I do what? not love what is wrong with my you? point guard to be such a high-volume shooter that oh he is. Oh, my Lord. He shoots it. Oh, he, my. You he, should be banned from he, talking like, basketball. Oh, really? Derek, Fit, Derek yeah. Rose. No, he Derek is Derek Rose. Fisher. I'll take De that. De <laughs> Derek <laughs> Rose. Yeah. Oh, what? You're, you know what? you're insane. You know what? He shoots way too many threes, especially in playoff games. He's going to jack it up six or eight, ten times from three, and he's going to make one of them. He's a miniature LeBron. You know it, and I know it. He, oh, no wow. way Scottie Pippen. Was a top 50 player. What? Michael Jordan made him. Yes, 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 yes. Don't get me started. You're going too far. No. You're going too far. I'm Scottie not. Pippen is all time 50 Hey, let me player. just ask you a question. What? What, what? what happened after the Bulls broke up and Scottie Are Pippen they, still? Wait, 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 wait. Is still in his prime. He, he went, wasn't in his prime. Yes, he was. He, he was, was not in his prime. Yes, See, you don't know basketball. You just got caught. You just got caught. It's official. <laughs> you don't know basketball. I'm like. I didn't say he's right now. I said I got a 38 year old point guard. Unlike Dirk Scott. Scottie Pippen played defense 94 feet. You don't forget, you don't remember that? What is it all about? Points? All, all time 50, one of the greatest players ever. You must be. I, I don't even know what to say to you right now. You said Scottie Pippen is one of not, not one of the all time 50 players. I don't even want to talk to you no more. Blasphemy. I don't even want to talk to you. you know, Stop it. What's really Stop. blasphemy what? is to say that Scottie Pippen's a top 50. Oh my player. Lord, you That's just don't. You, okay, I, I gotta say this. We're done. Tristan Thompson got me thinking about the damn Kardashians. Something ain't right. You're right about that. I mean, that. something ain't right. I mean, this dude. Listen, look, 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 look. Listen, 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 listen. This hurts, man. I, I'm saying this, this Kardashian curse might be real. It might be real. I mean, I got, I, listen, I love you. I love me some James Harden. I don't know what the hell happened. He might have contaminated him from years. I don't know. And something ain't right. But Tristan Thompson, what are you, 2.7 points? What? My, my God! You can get Porzingis and Carmelo. If they're just going to trade Carmelo, you can get them both they're right now. They're for free, pretty much. Any other team, Carmelo and Porzingis say, oh my God, we're almost all the way there. We need to make a few moves and look at us in a year or two. This is unbelievable. I've never heard you talk so fast <laughs> in your life. You, gotta, you guys look so depressed. All right. This damn Phil Jackson, man. He, he, he's just, I like he, the weight of that pen better than the paper. This, this man, this man has to go. Till Friday, they have a one nothing lead. They just trounced the Pelicans. Like, why would they play him? They would only play him because Steph is ready to go. Now, actually, I think the Pelicans can still get game, game two because now they're going to have to integrate Steph. I think the Pelicans will win two games in this series. I'll take them to extend the Warriors to, let's say, six games. But you just get blown out game one without Steph, or, or you don't have Steph, you blow out your opponent game one, now you're getting Steph back? Come on. What, am I going to pick the Pelicans? They got Steph back. Are you finished? For now. Do not interrupt me. Max Kellerman, <clears throat> let's be clear. Okay. Now you're the LeBron James doesn't play for numbers. You can see it in the way he plays. <laughs> he, tries to, he tries to make everyone hey, look, around him really better. Really, in God's name, hasn't appreciated LeBron James? Is LeBron underappreciated? What? Are you serious? I personally like LeVar Ball. I really, really do. I don't like some of the things that he's done to be been a bit too eccentric, but in the end, I respect the man, and I, and I and I genuinely like him. You pull your son out of school, you pull one son out of high school, you pull one son out of college, you take him to Lithuania. Who the hell is playing in Lithuania? Okay, and so my point is, I don't know if you, if you are defensive rebounding, you're limiting somebody else's shots. If you're offensive rebounding, you're giving yourself additional opportunities to score while also limiting somebody else's ability to shoot the ball because they don't have it, not to mention throwing off their rhythm. See, what happens, why that's so important against Golden State is because Golden State, it, it, it bl they blitz you. you I, watched, I watched these dudes in game three. 
I watched these dudes in game six, and they're down 15, and I go to the bathroom. <laughs> I finish going to the bathroom. I come out, and I decide, you know what I need? I want a pretzel. And the next thing you know, and I'm and let's face reality, I'm Stephen A. I ain't standing in line now. I'm not standing in line, okay? And I go get the pretzel, and I come, and they're up 13. <laughs> I mean, it's like, with, it, it's like called the pretzel it, it, it's, 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 it's a pretzel off. Call it whatever you pretzel want. It's like, it's, it's like, damn, you know, I'm, you know, but you, you blink, you miss it. These dudes, and it's like, it, it, I, I have never seen the close. Max Kellerman. Molly Wood stairs. Oh, oh, okay. Put Back the camera up, on me. Turn on the lights. The damn Washington Wizards. I'm calling you out. I'm so sick of these people. You know, oh, the, the Washington with John Wall had 35 and 11 last night. What the hell are you doing losing to the Utah Jazz without Rudy Colbert? How did that happen? This is a team, Max Kellerman. Do you know what the Washington Wizards record is against sub 500 teams? They're what 11 is? and 10. 11 and 10 against sub 500 Ain't teams. Get it done. You know, let me tell you something right now. And you know why that is? You know what I mean? Let me tell y'all why that is. Okay. Because if you notice, they play Cleveland tough. They play a lot of these teams tough. They got a better than 500 record against better than 500 teams, Max. Do you know why they have the record that they have against sub-500 teams? Because you play up to your competition, you play down to your competition. Right. You know what that means, Max? You think you have arrived. What the hell ready. has the Washington Wizards done to think they have arrived? Listen, I was in Atlanta to see them. Got nothing but love for the brothers. I root for them. I picked them to go to the conference finals last year. I was hoping they would do something this year. Y'all right now are looking like straight garbage. Bradley Bill, what the hell was that play last night? Where's that play? Do we have that play on film? I wish we had it because we needed to show how this dude goes up for a jump shot. Fix is going to get blocked and basically throws it to himself. How the hell has that happened? You're Bradley Beal. And oh, by the way, this is a guy that I walked up to in Atlanta, uh -huh. and I'm thinking all-star, all-star, all-star. And then I watched the next few games, and some of my peeps reminds me, hey, he ain't clutch. So I took the liberty of going to the research department. Of Get it together, Wizards. It. Get it together. You're too good for this. You need some tissues. This isn't good my... for your health. You can't get this. That is up. ridiculous. You're sweating. Max, take it away. My biggest. Who are you, Snoop Dogg in a green room? <laughs> I mean, what what the hell is going on? <laughs> what 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 what's next? What's next? I, I don't know. Codeine, weed, D, alcohol. I mean, what what's next? I agree. Fair enough. And on a lighter <clears throat> note, you mentioned J.R. Smith. He's putting together a reality show, and if you make a large enough donation, Skipper Stephen A., you might get a speaking role. Just wanted to throw that out there. You said, Hunter, are you joking? No, I'm being serious. He's, he's really about to be uh, have a reality TV yes, show? Yes, See, this is the damn problem. This, this is the problem right here. You, that's what you're telling me during the finals? Now we're hearing that he's going to have a TV show? Mm -hmm. that, a TV show for a dude that's played 69 well, minutes up. and it's only shot the ball nine times? Yeah. Well, wait a second. I think JR is going to have to pay Stephen A. Smith a whole lot of money to be part of that reality show. So he's, hold on, so he's, he, he, he's been on the floor for 69 minutes. Yep. Yeah. He's only attempted nine shots, has only made three as the starting shooting guard, and, and we're talking about him having a reality TV show? That's what y'all telling me? Well, well bad See, things the happen with in reality this shows, right? This is, it, it can this be is ugly. the problem Listen, with America. I was America. just suggesting a cameo maybe for yeah. you two. I thought this it could be good exposure. This is the problem with America. Yeah. The problem with America is people are being celebrated who don't deserve to be celebrated. Mm. With something first. All right. This is the problem. Let, let's go to break. Let's okay. just go to break. Speaking, this of, is disgusting. speaking of people being celebrated for... <laughs> the quarterback with the most to prove this weekend, Stephen A. Smith, is Tom... Brady. What? Oh. Tom Brady. You're the best. Tom Brady. Tom Brady has the most to prove. Hold on. The most hold on, hold on. to prove. Pause, pause, pause. Nick Foles. He's not going to be Case Keenum. Anyway. He's good. Everyone knows that. Blake Bortles. Blake Bortles, yeah. yeah. They have less to prove than Tom Brady? Blake Bortles has plenty to prove, not more than Tom Brady. You listen to this. I, 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 I can't take it. I, I, I can't take this. I, go ahead, Max. Go ahead, Max. Tom Brady go ahead. is the greatest quarterback I'm of listening. all time. Yes, he is. We're not talking about... These eyebrows that she's putting on right now, I already showed $400,000 a brow. And let's be clear, 
He stole his style from me. Mm. But a real announcer doesn't have to wear pants. <laughs> it's been a while. Well, first of all, I was born first. I was born first, what not you. What makes you think the unmitigated gonads for him to think that he was born first? They cut my eyebrows and use them for hair weeks. That's how great the grain of hair is. Let me explain something to you. Let me say Had something to you. we not been twins, I would have more hair. You took half of my hair. Little off the top, bang. You should understand what this is really about, and I'm not afraid of you. You need to be afraid That's of me. That's what you have to Because you don't know what I know. First of all, get your calves right, Steve. That's where your malnutrition is right there. You see the calves, you got to understand this. Of course, because two ballers are going to ball at all times. Arnold Schwarzenegger saw me and was like, yo, oh, I need those. I need Arnold Schwarzenegger saw me and said, he needs those. First of all, you was wrong about Tim T. I was not wrong about yes, Tim T. Ball. You were wrong about the Dallas Cowboys. I'm never wrong about you the Dallas Cowboys. You want me to Cowboys. kneel on you, you, right you, you now? I'm not afraid of you. I'm not you afraid of you either. About Isaiah Thomas. I was not. You was wrong. And Aaron Rodgers, Aaron Rodgers, he's not all that. Watch me kneel. I will kneel. He's, he's not, not a bad man. He's not a bad, he's not a bad man. man. Not. I'm not afraid. He's a sellout. You see that? He's not afraid. You don't see. I'll kneel. Are you kidding I'm me? I'm glad he's hurt. In front of everybody for my cause. I'm glad he's oh, hurt. I can't take it no right. more. Will you do the same, Stephen A. Smith? <laughs> ah, 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 ah. I don't care. I'm suing Gloria Allred. Get Gloria on the phone right now. It's ridiculous. It's crazy. He attacked me. He's my brother. He should have more respect for me than that. <laughs> Call Johnny Cochran. So I'm sorry is not good enough? I can't no, say it is not. I'm supposed to be your brother. You can't forgive me and not sue me? Look in my eye. Look what you did to me. It's unforgivable. C-Mac, roll me out of here. Oh, oh, oh. Bang! I love this brother. 